everybody on YouTube and welcome to Xbox Hit 54 Gaming! Yay! And today I am going to be reviewing, you might be able to tell right there on your screen, Zomblings. And um, my camera is on the tripod so the camera will be quite still. And um, basically, I'm going to show you my show you my zombies one by one, and then I'll show you my zombies, and then my crystal houses. So I'm going to start off with um, the zombies. So I've got this something here, one of the ones in my series four starter pack. Very interesting. We have this one, one of my newest ones. And then we have um this one. Looks like he's got the um, puffing out cheeks on a whistle there. That's all my series four, so then just started series four, so now series three. I got um this one. Pause the video if you um want to see any of these a little better. This one. And this one. Now we'll pause the video if you want to see these a little better. And this one. It might, it seems a bit pink on the camera, but it is, um, an orange. Might seem a little bit pink on the camera, though. Got, um, this one here. Reminds me of, um, a guy in Plants vs. Zombies God of Warfare. What was his name? Uh, Gargantua, that's what it was called. And then, this is one of my good, my good ones, because look what you can do. And this is what I, what if you want, if you like this video, do this on my video. Yeah, that's so funny. Remember, pause the video if you want to look at him. Then here's my limited edition zombie. It's from series three. Um, it's Scubo. I think his name is. I'm only saying the, the name for this one because. Um, he's one of my, he's my favorite one in in like at all. So that's him. And then we got him, who's quite interesting. Pause the video if you wanna check him out. And then we'll go into a couple of purples. We got this. Quite looks to me on this camera. It looks a bit blue, like of how like I can see what's it's recording. So it looks a bit blue on the camera, but I can promise you it is purple. So. And then we have this guy, it looks like he's got, um, uh, like a bucket and spade. Like a broken up, like a bucket and fork, like he's gonna go to the beach or something. Got a really interesting hat there. And this one, quite a dog. Looking one, so if I got a bit too close there. Um, he's quite interesting. Normally, if there's like non human based ones, they turn out to be quite interesting. There's not much color on zombies, which I actually think is a little bit better because I like them um, to have like little blind bag guys like these to be kind of like more like opaque kind of colors, like and like solid colors. And so, um, I guess, like, since I've got, like, holes on the bottom, and they're, and then they're, like, squidgy and stuff, I guess these guys, you could say, are kind of compatible with Trash Pack, if you have them, which I don't. Um, yeah, this is a chicken base one, I think. <coughs> Looks like he's got a bit of a trowel there, sorry for the only butt part of me there. And, um... 
there's um, this one, which I actually think when I opened the packet of a, zom of a single zombling and I got this guy, I was so, I was just lolling, like, for ages. He's so funny, like, he's, like, splurdy. It's like a little splodge of, like, yellow slime with, like, a seashell. Then we have, like, more of a postman than the guy with his thumb up. It's like, here's your letter. And um, I will give a tour of this um, in a minute. Well, actually, no, because I might end up filming a too much of the carpet or something. So, pause the video. Look. Look at this. And then we have um, this guy who's quite interesting. He's like this. Come on in. Come on in to this chain. Sorry. You must know password. I forgot. Or something like that. And um, then we have this guy. And if you guys um, don't recall, this is actually my first video on YouTube. So if you think this is all a bit bad, um, I apologize. I'm still learning of how to do videos. So might not be anything in the description or anything like that. But. Because, I mean, I'm only just, this is my first video, so it might be kind of bad. But if you don't recognise really good, um, I have you, I don't see any comments saying, Oh, you're so rubbish at video. It's because, um, it's just because, like, it's my first video and I'm still learning. So... This guy looks like a like an ill ram in a way. I mean, look at that ram horn there. Quite interesting. It might take a, a lot of the video to um uh to just like uh show all these guys off. So I might do a part two or something at some point. So this might look like a bit pink on the camera, but this is a red. He's only oh got my tripod's wobbling. Um, he's quite interesting for a zombling, actually. So, um, also, um, by their appearance in the comments, say, um, which out of these is your favourite zombling, and also if you, um, are from my class at school, then uh, tell me by its appearance. What zombling you might want to trade with me, possibly? And then we got, and I'll do like possibly like um you know collection updates and stuff of zombling's, mm. which I'll only show the new ones. So we got this green snowman, which actually is quite an interesting one. We got a red skunk, which is kind of weird. Looks pink on the on this camera. This is a normal camera, so. Um, and I've got my light on in my room, so this might be kind of bad quality, but, yeah. Got a yellow cat, zom cat or something like that, I guess you could call it. This one's actually kind of weird, because look, if you see that, its ear is tied on by a bit of rope. Which, I, in my opinion, it just doesn't make sense. And then we got this squid. Quite interesting. Minus the advertisement for... I listic squids channel there. We have um uh, orange ghost, which its real name in zombies is actually Fonto, but I call it Clyde because it looks like um Clyde from Pac-Man. <laughs> I know shows a purple ghost in Pac-Man because they've there's a, another there's a purple version of Fonto in the in um, Zombie Series Three. So yeah, we got this is actually one of the first zombies I ever opened. I like him because look, he is um his arm with the uh, the bone in is kind of flexible, so it looks like you can make him play like like down 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 down. Coming towards the end of the zomblings bit of the like the general zomblings part of this video, we got this one. Normally with collectors stuff like this, if they have like female things. 
they actually turn out to be quite interesting, especially for zombies. We got a dog, which is interesting. He um, his knit like he kind of he he would kind of fit in with um dog from uh series two. He's one of the ultra rares. If you collect zombies series two, then you should know that. And we got this guy. I call him Goblin Santa Sumo because the sumo bit, sumo bit is the how um like solid his chest looks, and then the Santa bit is the Santa hat, and then we got um the Goblin bit is um like the um Goblin ears. It might even be elf ears. And then we have this guy who's also one of my first guys I ever opened too. And then last no the last no um zombling is this guy. So if this um video is a little bit long for you guys, so now we're gonna have the zombies, which I only have two zombies and they're both scooters. So I'll show you my special one first, which is the, um you only get chrome ones from the starter kits for series four, but look at that. Look at that chrome green scooter ride. And they actually have the the pole the um, stick um little um stick on there, so you can sit a zombling in there. So if you like um if you would want that, then you can do that. I guess you could um balance a like a little bit of the Lego mini a Lego mini figure's leg on there. And I'm not going to show you much of the red, but pause the video if you want to have a look at it. It looks pink. It's actually red. Like it looks pink on the camera. I might. It might for you. I'm not entirely sure if this colour thing. It's just like a power. I can see what's recording on the video. It looks like it's different coloured. And I'm going to show you the green crystal house from Series Three. Um, these houses are kind of interesting because it opens up the full, pretty much full front instead of just the door, which is, I think is kind of better because then it's easier to <coughs> get your zombies in there. Excuse me. And then we got the an orange one. Throw zombies in there if you wish. And then we have the um the red one. So this video is start is gonna um I think this is gonna be the end of the video here. So um sorry about that, I need the tripod a bit, sorry. Um so that's gonna be the end of the video here. So I'm gonna thank you very much for watching guys and I'll see you in the next one if I even make a new one. Which I sure hope so, because I really enjoyed this, so I'll see ya. Bye!